Ask Reddit, what's the most damage you can cause with $10? Damage to others or to yourself, cause you can buy cats movie tickets. Calm down, Satan. Pouring caramel on someone's windshield. We actually did that to someone in high school, but used honey and then poured about a pound of glitter on top of it. The person kept being a dinkhead and doing pranks like letting air out of our tires and shaving cream on the door handles and stuff. And we kept telling them to stop. We bought a gallon of honey and probably a pound or two of glitter and covered their windows. That was 10 to 12 years ago. It's probably still on there. Buy a plastic deck chair and leave it in a massive intersection. I heard this caused a six lane each way highway to jam for hours once. My sister and I placed a box of cereal in the middle of an aisle at the grocery store. It caused a traffic jam affecting the other aisles. Nobody would pick it up and put it away. Everyone tried really hard not to hit it with their carts. Buy a bag of fries. Take it to an outdoor subway, underground, whatever station. Slowly feed bits of the fries to pigeons. Amass several hundred pigeons in front of you, waiting for fries. When the next train comes, just before the doors close, hurl the entire bag of fries into the car. So the pigeons follow it into the car. But the people don't have time to get out. Ideally, do it just before a long section without any stops followed by several underground stations. Repeat 15 times, fries are cheap. Fill someone's exhaust with Expandafoam. Find twin three-year-old boys at Walmart, show them the money, and tell them whoever makes more people scream inside the store can have it. $10 can buy a bottle of gut wrench vodka, it's like an adult choose your adventure book with every choice leading to incarceration. Spend $5 on super glue, use glue to secure the other five to the floor of a Walmart entrance on Black Friday. $9.50 worth of glitter and a stamp addressed to a clean lab environment. Buy a thing of ladybugs and release them into someone's house. Use the leftover cash to buy mint seeds and plant them in the same enemy's front lawn. They'll never get it all out. Crickets. They're way worse. They make noise and have a curious habit. They won't leave a dark place into a bright one so the little bastards won't come out of their hiding spots until it is nighttime and the lights are off. Real fun in college dorms when you can't turn the lights off in the hallway. Release a bag of crickets when everyone is asleep and they'll immediately seek out the darkest area they can find. The crack under everyone's doors. Buy some gallium. It literally eats aluminum. Just a small amount will kickstart a chemical chain reaction that will eat through aluminum like popcorn at the movies. It's quite slow. 10 milliliters will eat through one centimeter sheet of aluminum in about six hours. It soaks into the aluminum and spreads incredibly far. Google it. One large drop on your stepdad's engine on his nice sports car will literally make the engine casing fall apart faster than your emotions. Good luck. Wear goggles. Hire two private investigators to investigate each other on Fiverr. Guy 1 delivers complete biography containing Guy 2's innermost secrets and all info you will ever need to steal his identity, along with a cost breakdown on why Guy 1's services are better than Guy 2's. Guy 2 mails you macaroni art that reads, I like turtles. Why is nobody mentioned yet the one pound bag of Haribo sugar-free gummy bears? If you have that one friend, that one person who you know loves to binge on candy, give them that bag and then block the entrance to the washroom. Read the reviews on Amazon, you won't regret it. Exchange the $10 for 1,000 pennies. Pay a $10 lunch in a super busy fast food restaurant with only pennies. Two words, liquid ass. Two more words, I'm thirsty. Easy, buy a bucket for a dollar at a Dollar Tree, then buy all the glitter possible. 
Fill the bucket with glitter. You wait until someone's asleep. Then you slowly start pouring the glitter all over them. They wake up to glitter everywhere. Purchase a family supersized carton of Idahoan brand instant mashed potatoes. Go to toilet and add the potatoes until the water starts to thicken. It's tricky because too much will cause it to fail and too little and it won't be flushable. Flush the toilet 10 to 12 times. Repeat process and flush 8 times. Repeat process and flush 5 times. Do this until the can is empty. With fewer flushes between each, from what I understand, they got two router trucks and then a plumber over to that place, it would unclog and then stop right up again in a couple hours. Eventually, they gave up and the commode in that bathroom never was able to be used again. I was also given to know that the reek was enough to gag ya after time had passed. And the best part, I had enough change for a beer once my work was done. Guy who lived there was ballistic. All I had to say to him was, baked, boiled, or mashed, butthole. Priceless and pretty nice bang for under 10 bucks. Donate it to Scientologists in the name of the Catholic Church and watch the financial begging go back and forth until it becomes a full-on financial and religious war. I don't even have to have $10. I can destroy the entire customer and billing database of a huge company because someone got lazy and created a job with admin rights that will run literally any SQL you put in it. Sure, there is a backup, but it would shut the company down for at least two days while it gets all sorted. If I really wanted to F it up, I could change all the customer balances to zero or one million dollars or random numbers or change all the mailing addresses to your mom's house. And I could probably run it from anywhere with the admin login, so it would be untraceable, except for this post and the fact that only four people know about it, and of the four, only two are capable of writing the SQL, and only one has enough experience to know what to hit. I was gonna comment something, but I don't wanna go to jail, so I'm not gonna. Hit that subscribe button and drop a like for more Reddit readings and Reddit stories.